Welcome to my channel. My name's Jordy, if you don't know me, and today I tried to turn myself into Lana Del Rey. And I'm not totally happy with it, but I worked on it a lot. It was really difficult, challenging. I still feel quite Lana-esque. If you'd like to see how I transformed into Lana Del Rey, then keep watching. All right, so I did shave my brows for this one. No, I didn't. I'm just kidding. What actually happened was I accidentally got some shape tape on my brows. No, that didn't happen either. I just glued them down with a glue stick. If you would like to see how I did it, I will link up here my Betty Boop video where I glued my brows down and there's like a copious amount of how to cover your brows videos on YouTube. I'm gonna jump right into the contouring using my Anastasia Cream Contour Kit in Fair. I'm going to start by contouring my cheekbones. Hers are higher than mine. I would normally contour about here, but for this look, bringing it up. I'm going to bring that down on more of a slant. Because looking at photos of her, they come down at more of an angle. And of course, everything is going to be super exaggerated because I am trying to make my face look like someone else's face. Under the cheek contour, I'm going to add highlight. Make this area of my face come forward to accentuate that contour. Now I'm going to contour my chin and jawline. Her chin is a little bit more straight across than mine. So I'm just going to go in and shade it right across. And then she has a really straight Line. Literally just trying to draw her face onto mine. She has a tiny bit of a dimple on her chin as well. Right now I just look like I have a sick chin strap. Now going in with one of the light shades. I'm just going to highlight accentuate the chin and just bring this highlight over to make it look like my chin is wider. And I'm going to add a little bit of shading top of the chin right here. Now I'm going to move on to the nose, which is always my favorite part. Okay, so her nose is really, really skinny. It's wider at the top. Also has a cute little shape on the end of her nose. And she has that super cute little line that goes down that I probably will draw again after I blend it all out. just pretending that I have eyebrows to attach my nose to. I'm adding these lines down the sides to make it appear that this part of my nose is smaller. And then shading this area of my nose to kind of just make it disappear. Now that I'm somewhat happy with the shape, I'm going to go in and add some highlights and see how it looks.
gonna shade a little bit above my nostril to make this part look like it comes down farther because I think that's why it's not quite looking like her nose is that my nose doesn't have this little piece it just has a ring in it I'm gonna leave the nose as is for right now because I feel like I've been working on it for a really long time. I'm just gonna add some quick shading to the top of my forehead. I'm not too worried about the forehead because I am going to put on a wig. All right, I'm gonna go in and set some of these areas with powder. It is time for brows. So the reason that I covered my brows is that her brows sit significantly lower than mine do and so I wanted to cover mine. For her brows, I'm going to use the LA Splash Ultra Defined Brow Mousse in Dahlia. And just looking at a picture of her brows, I'm going to put them on my face. Done. Oh my god, can you imagine? I look <laughs> I look like some kind of creature right now. Oh my god, I look so weird. So weird. I'm just taking my Happy Girls Shine Brighter palette from Tarte. I'm gonna grab that white as a base. While I have this palette, I'm going to grab some of this dark brown. And I'm just going to pop some hair strokes into the brows. Looking a little two-dimensional. It feels weird not to gel them, but there's no hair. Back to the eyes. I'm going to keep it super simple. I'm just going to grab this light brown from my Urban Decay Ultimate Basics palette. I'm just gonna put that in the crease, just in a really round shape. She's got really round eyes. I'm going back to the brows. That's better, that has had too much of an arch. It's a little bit better. Getting real fed up with these brows. Just going in with that brown shade that I was using before I Going back to the brows. And I'm just blending that out, and that is all I'm going to do for the upper lid. In the Love music video, she has like the thinnest wing ever, and I'm a little bit scared. Here we go! Using my Kat Von D tattoo liner, lining the lid super, super thin. And then just doing a super long little baby wing. With a wing that thin, you only get one chance. I feel like I look so angry with these brows. I'm going to add mascara to my top and bottom lashes. And then in the video, she's just wearing a half lash in the outer corner using a Red Cherry 510 lash chopped in half. While the glue is getting tacky, I'm going to put on some Essence Snowflake Shadow as a highlight. Add some of that to my cheeks and nose. And a little bit to my chin, under my pretend brow, and then this lash should be ready. For the lip, I'm going to use a Bite Lip Pencil in number 14. And I'm bringing them farther over this way because her lips are wider than mine. I'm going to use Skinny Dip Gloss by DNA Cosmetics. 
I'm just gonna add some Jumbo Milk Pencil by NYX in my waterline. I'm gonna put a tiny bit of black liner along the bottom lash line. I'm gonna put on a little bit of blush from my Ofra blush book. And then I'm gonna give it a spray so it doesn't look so powdery. And put on my wig and style my hair. In the video for love, her hair is really dark and she has the bangs pulled back. And she has all these pretty little daisy type flowers in her hair. All right, folks, that's it, that's all. Let me know in the comment section if you think I look like Lana. Also, please let me know if you like these kinds of videos, if you'd like to see more transformations, and who you would like me to try and turn myself into. It is really fun and it's really, really challenging, so I like that. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.